Yes, welcome to the Dark Mark Show. I am Dark Mark, the goth comedian. You know, you can use a cup. They have cups outside. I wanted him to clean it up for me. I give her a cup. Ooh. I give her a cup. We're trying to figure out the best uh, mix of vodka, 7-Up 10, and orange juice. And I don't know if we've got it quite right yet, but... Uh, <laughs> I, I am Dark Mark, the goth comedian. Uh, welcome to the lighter side of the dark side, your uh, Thursday Night Freak Show. And, boy, we have, a, we have a good one. We've got braids. We've got masks. We've got <laughs> all sorts of pigtails. pigtails Thank and you. And we have a uh, Josie Cat is tardy as usual, but she'll be here. And uh, we have, an, if you were a regular viewer of the show, you remember her. Who could forget, although her name changes almost daily, <laughs> in Vexi Lee, formerly yeah. Buggy Nova, formerly Skylar Moon. Hi, hi. We're going to get into all that. If you're a wrestling fan, you know her from the WWE, from NWA, from uh, all sorts of things. Right next to her is a guy. That, see, people would think you are the wrestler, but you're not. You are you're you're from the uh, internet show Pink Lady and Scone. And uh, the, yes, the the new adventures of Pink Girl and the Scone, and I am the Scone. Okay, the Scone is here. Mm-hmm. At Scone, do you have a real name, or do we don't we do we want to keep the illusion for a while? Um, yes, I have I have a real name. Go okay. with the illusion. We'll go with the yeah. illusion. We'll get the real name later. Scone's here. And next to Scone, Skid Row Studios' own finally made the made the the Dark March show. I'm glad he's here. David Berger, the yeah. host of I'm Burger, he's part of our comedy lineup here every Thursday night. There's me with my crazy wa- wacky friends, well, wild stuff. Last week we had some spanking. We had some, we had some choking. Yeah, we had. Where choking. was I? I? You're welcome anytime. Next week we're gonna have fire play. We're gonna have all sorts of stuff. But uh, I took a fire play class. Side note. Well, we'll, we'll uh, let me let me bookmark okay, that. Okay, I've okay. got that fireplay class. I will ask about <laughs> fireplay class, but uh, but your uh, your show. And then afterwards, we have uh, Nestorius. Yes, which is like a, going to a uh, a, a uh, barbershop in Spanish Harlem with a bunch of guys talking shit. Blackest dude in radio. Yes, yeah. and, and then we've got Einberger, which uh, you, you got to listen to his show. It's great. It's him. He's like, and, and don't let the hippie hair fool you. This guy. Is full of anger, full of venom. This guy rages against the machine. He's got a bunch of funny comics. He just started. <laughs> they, they just started with a shock collar, so it, they have a trivia contest with shock collar. Yeah. I, have, I have a few announcements before we get started. And we've got quite a. We're gonna have a quite a show. But Saturday night, if you're in Los Angeles, this coming Saturday night, which is the seventh, I will be uh, as I will be uh, hosting the Symbol Six Dirty Land. Album release party at Five Star Bar. And, and Symbol Six has been on the show. They're an old school punk band. They, uh, when they were 15, 16, they were touring with it. They were doing shows with Germs, Fear, X, yeah. all those great old bands, Social Distortion. Then they oh, took yeah. a hiatus. They're just, they've been around so long. Izzy Stradlin from Guns N' Roses used to roadie for them. Oh, good the God, yeah. Wow. And now they're back after like a 30 year hiatus. Better than ever. Matter of fact, let's hear one of their songs. <laughs> That's enough of a taste. If you want some of that and you want some of my comedy, although you've you've opened for bands, uh, David, you know what it is. You oh, tell, it's a gr- yeah, it's you tell so a couple jokes. You tell a couple jokes. Nobody's listening, and then you're like, anybody like pussy and beer? Everybody cheers. Yeah. You're like, you're ready to rock, yeah. and then the bands come on. So that's all I do. Yeah, just nonstop, ready to rock. Right. So uh, two six seven South Main Street, Los Angeles nine zero zero one two, probably right around the corner. Uh, Five Star Bar Saturday night. I will be hosting the Symbol Six label party and uh, the uh, record release party and then next week friday the 13th i will be performing my one-man show i laughed so hard i cried as part of the hollywood fringe festival and uh this this will be at 8 30 
uh, Friday the 13th, because I know a lot of people, uh, a lot of my friends are going to the Fetish Club afterwards, Black Unicorn, which is at the Dragonfly. But this is a block away from the Dragonfly. So here's some comedy. Have some laughs, and then go to the Dragonfly and get freaky. It's at the Complex Theaters, 6476 Santa Monica Boulevard. If you go to hollywoodfringe.org, order tickets, use the coupon code GOTH, you get tickets for 5 bucks. Nice. Otherwise, they're $12 at the door. Good deal. So, yes. So then... Uh, those are all my those are all my uh, announcements. Actually, uh, one more announcement because Josie Cat is on her way. Her band Carrera will be, will be playing at Skinny's in the Valley on Lancashire Boulevard on Wednesday night. Uh, Carrera, that's always a fun fun night with Scum Love. So the show starts in Vexy Lee, formerly Buggy Nova. He's still in my phone as Buggy Nova. Keep it that way. So what happened? Why did the first off? Did he, have either of you figured out what a Vexy Lee means? Because I haven't. She keeps it deeply secret. Mindy, do you know what? It, do you, did you get it? What vex, a vexi? In, in I N V E X I, last name Lee. Oh, in vexi. In vexi Lee. Vexi Lee. In well, vexi vex Lee. Is actually wait wait to vex is something ha. And that's like Lee, Lee like the fake Bruce Lee, not the real yeah, Bruce Lee. Yeah, the vex is yeah. to curse, right? I thought that was to hex. Well, it, no, it, hex, it, it has well, a why lot of why don't we have yeah. why don't we have the source tell us why you change of... your name from Buggy Nova to in vexi Lee? Well, I changed it to kind of um, leave the buggy persona behind because I'm kind of slowly but surely kind of creeping away from wrestling. the wrestling world. And, you know, a lot of people know me as Buggy, you know, Buggy the Wrestler. And um, that's just the association. And, and funny me, I, I'm the one that posted a picture of you with a bunch of bugs on Facebook. No, uh, I love it. And a lot I of people love, love that. I still love bugs. Yeah? I love it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, and... Uh, that hasn't changed. Okay, so are, are you are you pissed off because your real name is on the Wikipedia page? Yes. <laughs> you any of your <laughs> What's your real name? Natalie, are you upset that your real name is on is on there? Um. Yeah, you know, when I, when I w was signed and... Uh, and they told me, you know, they didn't have a name for me yet, and I, I had to use my real name. I was like, oh, okay, I guess I that's, didn't have a choice. That's when you were signed to WWE. Yeah, and I think that's when everybody found out my real name because before I was really good at keeping it a secret, right? And I wanted to keep it that way, but it's out there, and you know, who cares? Right, but it, it, they're never going to change. It's just like, okay, Natalie, and then Buggy, Buggy Nova. There's a few of them. Yeah, yeah, I have Skylar Moon, Skylar Moon, Donna Dead. Is yeah, on there. I, I missed Donna Dead. That was good. Yeah, I know. I wish I could play her again. That was for the uh, the Glow re reunion show. Is there another Donna Dead that's wrestling now? If there better not be. Oh, okay. You kick her ass? <laughs> I would. <laughs> I think you know, I will, I will say that someone stole a little bit of my wrestling persona. I'm not going to say any names. Right. But, you know, there's there's a couple people out there. Shame on you, John Cena. We know, John who, Cena. We know who, who you are. I was going to say Seamus. Yeah. <laughs> we talked about Seamus last night. I didn't, I, had no idea, I didn't know Seamus at all. I saw a picture of you with Seamus. He's a big wrestling fan, too. Okay, nice. good. Then we, we can talk wrestling. So yeah. all the mistakes I make. Well, actually, it's weird. I was driving here, and uh, I usually have serious radio, but then one of, my, one of my things went out. It's on order. So I've been listening to Jack FM. And it was kind of sad because Hulk Hogan's doing a commercial for like 1-800 car loans. Yeah, I heard. With the millions yeah. and millions of dollars that that guy has. Hey, brother, we got pin it down. Pin down that loan. And you're like, oh, <laughs> it's horrible. I know. But he's doing it with Elway. No, no, no. No, this is a different one. Oh, but he did one with John Elway. Yeah, this, this is, this is this, the, yeah, that, that's different. That was like uh, RTO or something. Yeah. Now he's gone like radio commercials for uh, like, you know, ba there's basically check casting places now. And oh, the other one I was listening to, they had a... Uh, because you're a comedian. This is uh, Dave Berger's a, a very good comedian. Uh, he's His name is on the, the wall of the comedy store. Cool. Which means shit nowadays, but thank you. Well, you're on there with Jimmy yeah. and Joey and all of right, our favorites. Right, right, but, yeah. uh, I'm Matt Edgar. Hey, yeah. I can suck a dick. <laughs> hey, everyone look at me blowing Jeff Garland. Anyway, go on. Sorry. But anyway, so uh, um. but they had they had a Jeff Foxworthy commercial because he's playing. But it was weird because he had all, it's the same jokes, but he doesn't say redneck anymore. Is he not allowed to? I don't know. It was weird because he's doing this show. He did the joke. If you're, if both your uh, butt cheeks look like uh, an unmowed lawn, you shouldn't wear spandex. No. You're like, what? What? What, are you what are you talking? It was weird. Really? Well, let me let me tell you. Let me introduce you to David Berger because I know you guys are getting chummy in, in the hallways. He does. First off, the braids. We got to talk about the braids, David. What, 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 now you've grown. How long does it take you to grow your hair that long? And how much is? How long does it take you to braid it in the morning? It only takes me about a minute or two. It, the braiding's easy. I, I grew. I grew it out for locks of love, and so because it's been, I've donated twice, and so it takes about a year and a half, two years to grow it. Really? Um, I don't think I've ever seen you with short hair. 
Oh, yeah, when I, yeah, you did. Well, when I, I, just, I guess comedy, I didn't recognize I had a shaved head. <laughs> I guess I didn't recognize Yeah, you. when I first started comedy, I had a shaved head. Oh, okay. or, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, my, 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 my memory's fuzzy. I don't know, maybe the, uh, the combination. Corbin Bowl. The vodka, orange juice. Yeah, and the, Corbin yeah. Bowl, Dante. Oh, God, don't remind me of those First days. wife cheated, second wife cheated. You know, all the, you remember him? I remember, yeah. yeah, I remember all that. Yeah, it was the whole thing. It was fun. That place was the, where comedy went to die. It was, but a great place, and I met great people there. Right. But I had short hair. But what's, what's, fun, what's funny about this is uh, I was watching, I was read one of your bios on one, some, some website, and it, it called you an Aryan-looking Jew, which is, which is funny because I'm a Jewish-looking Aryan guy. Right. You stole my look. <laughs> I was serious. supposed to look and, like and, you. And Natalie, your last name is Osman. Are you Jewish? I'm not Jewish. Okay. So, uh, and uh, and that's the last time I'll say your real name. Are you, are you Jewish? Yeah. Okay. But because uh, uh, Stephen Glickman said I'm the most Jewish looking non Jew he's you ever are. seen yeah. in your life. But I didn't. I didn't peg you as Jewish. Hundred percent. Like right. pure bloodline. Everybody prior to my wife's and kids, um, wife, ex wife, wife. You know. But I have kids from each. Um, and besides them, all the way back, all Jews. Right? Well, he kind of yeah. looks like Jesus. Does that count? Right, he right. Does, he, does, he, does, right. Well, he does. He does. He does. Well, he does sort of look like Jesus. <laughs> well, Jesus. When, when you open your mouth, still, it kind of kills yeah. it. But yeah, you, yeah. You, you do. You do sort of have that. You do sort of have that Jesus look. Ginger Jesus. Well, no, I'm a school teacher, Ginger special Jesus. education, right? Well, that, I was going to get to that. And I, I did it in South Central LA, so it was kind of like Jesus. I but was you grew up in Pacoima. What? You grew up in Pacoima. Not a lot of Caucasians, Jewish or otherwise. No. No, no, not at all. Not a lot of Jews. There was one other Jew who was in Lake Futuris. Guy Dave Weinstein. And we met up somehow. He was over in Lake Futeris. I was in Bacoima, and we got together and started like a... A bris, or... Well, we started a gang. It was hip-hop oh, okay. Hebrews. A we were pretty gang. hardcore, yeah. 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 We would, yeah. Uh, you know, go around Mazel Tov and, and, <laughs> right, right. and... But no, yeah. And, and the Beastie Boys beat you to it, so I don't know what oh, you... son of a bitch. Yeah. 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 Everyone, everyone's Jewish. That's the, yeah. that, that's the thing, you know, and... But yeah, Well, it yeah. doesn't matter. I'm just saying it's it's funny that, uh, that, that you... Because you... you, you I, I, about five times in the studio, you, you you call me a goth Jew, and I'm not. Oh, you are, yeah. Yeah, I know. And I'm not. And, and it was well, so I think weird. someone's lying. Like someone just escaped uh, the Holocaust, buddy, and oh, didn't okay. tell you. Yeah, it could be. Yeah, I think they were like, you know, fuck it, just shut up, say you're Italian. <laughs> okay. Your, got, your mom I've was got, like, I've got the what do you mean I'm Italian? Hey, I'm, uh, you know. My, my, I've got the pasta recipe to, yeah. to prove it, David. Fazul! Yes. She's like, what's the wrong with the you? <laughs> so, and then, yeah, so, so Scott, I know you're alive. I'd buy it. Scott, I know nothing about you, but you are a big wrestling fan. Oh, and he's got a great mask. He does, the, the, the mask is cool. Yeah. yeah I actually I like have, I have a question for yeah. you, though. If you if you donate your braids to Locks of Love, do the children know when they feel their hair? They're like, this came from a, a man. Like, because like, I, I, I tend to think of women as donating their hair. Well, no, but uh, by but, the way, I love yeah. the scone voice. That is great. Yeah, but uh, this I is do real donate, voice. I don't know what yeah. you guys are talking about. Hello, do you, it, it's hair. <laughs> they get the hair, but somehow they become a little weird, a little oh. more fucked up. You How, know? Do you know but, if your yeah. hair's gone to women? Is I think is what you're like. No, you know what? That's a big thing with me because I was doing locks of love, and the, and they give away or they sell off more than half the freaking hair and make a profit, and they've mm. profited over millions of dollars, which is a fraud, and they're not nonprofit. But St. Jude's. Gives it all. Mm. And so it's a much better thing. So I do St. Jude's. And yeah, no, trust right. me, if I see some woman with a redheaded weave, I'm ripping it off her fucking head. Because <laughs> Invexi will tell you that uh, there's women that would kill for head of hair like that. Oh, yes. Not that your hair. I mean, you you always got gorgeous hair. Thank you. you. you all natural. Yes. Yeah, you got great hair, yeah. Yeah, I could see <laughs> a lot of people with blonde and, 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 and blonde it's streaks. It's natural. I've never dyed this. <laughs> anyway, uh, <laughs> Yeah, that's uh, that's like me. But it, actually, so you're getting out. Of <laughs> I'm so slow. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's a fast show, Dan. We gotta eat. I just hit me. Even the scones like. like, like, uh, it's like wow, that's natural. Uh, what am I even? The scones ready, ready to get crumpets. And wait till Josie comes here. But no, I, I love. Yeah, I, 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 I think the hair. Now here's the thing. As as with last time, and and Dave will tell you, he's heard my show. I do extensive research when I have my female guests. Ooh. Oh yeah. Extensive. Uh oh. Extensive. Many will tell you. What'd you I find? Lots, it wasn't me. Lots and lots of research. But uh, I, I, I researched you, and I found some new pictures that I hadn't seen before. Nude or new? Uh, I, <laughs> no comment. But okay. I saw the... No, I don't think you have new yeah. pictures well, that I've seen. I've tried. Do you? No, I don't mean that apparently, weird. Yeah. Apparently you do, so I'll have to do some more research. I was researching it. I was researching it at <laughs> no work. Comment. No, but uh, I will tell you what is nude. If you go to wikifeet.com, oh, yes. they love your feet. I have uh, four and a half stars out of five, by the way. You do, you do. No, you, you are one of the top-rated nice feet, feet of the female wrestlers. Yes, wow. thank you. 
Uh, the, the, the scone just perked up and lost his voice. I, but, that's uh, impressive. So, uh, so uh, you you must have pretty feet. I mean, I, I've seen pictures of you barefoot. Yeah, but I'm not a foot guy. So it's like you know, I'm, I'm uh, quite honestly. I'm not a foot uh, guy either. I I'm don't get it. Off. I mean, looking at your tits and ass, I'm not really looking at your feet. Yeah, thank you. So, I mean, I'm sure they're fine. <laughs> you know, well, they do matter though to the sense of like you don't want someone who's walking around throwing gang signs. You know, I mean, like you oh, want someone. Yeah. With are, you yeah. feet? are you into yeah. feet burger? Seriously? No, I'm just not into disgusting feet. You know what I'm saying? There's like, some pretty gnarly yeah. feet out there. If, if a woman is beautiful like let, let's take in vexy for example and her feet were a little like you know maybe yeah, done yeah no nah. toenail was a little long um, or there was a bunion or my wife got a size 11 foot oh, perfect really? feet though like nothing wrong now, with what, normal what, define a perfect foot Me, that, that's what again, i want to know again i wish i had footballs okay. in here because I, I don't know all the toes are in agreement <laughs> you know, okay, right. so what, that second, that what if that second one's a little bigger? Yeah, no, no. Well, that just means they're a little smarter if it's on one what? foot. Yeah, yeah, it's a thing. Yeah, okay. it's a weird thing so, from way if, back when. It probably is bullshit. No, it probably is. What if the second toes like, 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 like real small? Well, no, that's not okay. See, that's the thing. They all got to be in agreement, and they all got to come from the same like type. They got to go like this. Like, okay, you next, you next, you next. Big toe. Like stairs, right? Yeah, yeah. They shouldn't be all like. And, and, and yeah. Scone, please uh, pipe in here because I, I, I mean, I'm, I, I'm just trying to figure out. You want the toes to be cheering each other on? Pretty much to be friends. Yeah, All right. yeah to you work together like a good family. family. Yeah. Yeah. Like they're doing a cheerleading other. pyramid. That, you, you, yeah, yeah, you want a pyramid of toes is what That's, you're looking for. All it is is they should just all do the same triangle thing. triangle of toes. Yeah. yeah, you've been with, you've probably been with a woman or so that you know, like I said, once or twice. Has, she has like toes where one's going right, one's going left. The other one, the nail just decided to go right. You're just like, what the fuck? Yeah, like you can't take her to L.A. because you'll get shot if it's the wrong way. I'm trying to think uh, the the most jacked up feet I've ever been with. They've never been that bad. But I think maybe small toes. Like I, I it was uh, I, small toes. Like there's like a big corn. big toe. Like Dominican toes. woman toes. Like them little chiapin toes. I, I don't know Dominican women. <laughs> like, she was, look like she, <laughs> she was white. She was actually Jewish, but okay. she. She had the, oh yeah, the, the big hairy toe knuckle was like, toes. No, 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 no. She didn't. No, no hair. I I've been with hairy knuckles, but <laughs> that's not what I'm Ooh. thinking. Yeah. But hey, beggars can't be choosers. No. <laughs> but we got. Uh, but they had the big toe was normal size, and then the the other toes were real small. Oh yeah. Oh. I didn't give a shit. No, the yeah. rest of her is beautiful. Nah, that that yeah, must have no. been like like having like she had D cups. I didn't even look at her feet. Yeah. I didn't yeah. see gums them. and little teeth except for toes. I just, you know what it is? I just like a woman who just looks <laughs> I like, get it. you know what it is? It's <laughs> like, I, yeah, you shouldn't have crazy <laughs> shit, man. You know, you shouldn't, you shouldn't, like, you shouldn't have They're a big toe thumb. They're having a whole other show over there. Like, you shouldn't have a big toe thumb. You shouldn't have different shit. Women, it just throws well, you what, up. What's, what's, what's a big toe thumb? I, I, this is what it's I, where I, your thumb looks like it came off your foot. Okay. Like, it, like, they took your big toe and stuck it on your fucking hand. Is it that just like Megan odd. Fox's thumb? Yes! All yes. Right. Okay, so uh, <laughs> Megan Fox <laughs> motherfuckers for a good reason. That? Does Megan Fox have fucked up feet? No, no she's got a th- hand. She got a she's thumb. Got a- Thumb finger. Yeah, yeah. Or a toe finger. She got a toe finger. Oh, I heard yeah. about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something that, like that. That doesn't, doesn't bother me. Uh, I'd huh. on it. It would drive me cr- I have so much ADD. It would make me <laughs> nuts. So when your wife, when you first met your wife, was she wearing open toe shoes? Yeah, yeah, but this is the thing is, like, that's what I mean. It's like, okay, like, this is the thing. Symmetrically and everything else, you have a great look. You have a really appeasing look. Your smiles match your face. Nothing's bigger than it should <laughs> be. Nothing's so. smaller. You. <laughs> no. Most people are not symmetrical. My wife is. Everything like kind of works. It's not about being perfect. That per- it's about being symmetrically perfect. I've read that. Yeah, yeah. 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 So tonight in the like Dark the Bar eye. Show, David Berger uh, reads a love letter to his wife. Right. And I think Josie's here. Um, Josie. Josie. Let me double check this text. Yes, uh, Mindy. If somebody can come, if somebody can come get Josie in the, in the lobby, please. And uh, she's gonna. Hate herself for missing the t- the feet conversation. Right, oh, yeah. she hasn't learned how to credit card the front door yet. <laughs> See, you're usually there, so yeah. Well, yeah, about this time. So wait, so you're, you're you, now your feet from wrestling, you would think would be a little little coarse and yeah, callous. yeah, and from soccer and from volleyball. I mean, you played sports? soccer. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, he's from Did you hear that? My whole life I played. Yeah. Oh hell yeah. yeah. yeah my, I, daughter, I, my, childhood, my oldest daughter just did tournament. Sorry. Oh, yeah. Yay. Yeah. He's, 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 so a, he's a proud father. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And by the way, <laughs> if you've never heard on Burger, this is a show that's that's ever evolving. But now you do a trivia contest where you shock the guests with a shot collar. Is that correct? What? Well, yeah. <gasps> we, well, here's the thing: is we just <laughs> it's kind of like it's kind of like a charitable thing. Only there's nothing going to charity. What we do is we put like a shot collar on them and we ask them trivia questions. Two of them and it's okay. They're wrongs. comedians. That's so right. exciting. They get shocked. And wow. so like, if he gets it yeah. wrong, he gets shocked. Yeah. <gasps> and I heard this week you're going to have Perry Kurtz and Billy Bats. Well, Perry backed out because sure he's he 105 years old. He, he was doing comedy back when, like, oh, uh, Socrates was. And so he George was kind of stole jokes off yeah. him, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah George. Oh, my God. And <laughs> I don't even want to get into his rapping. 
Were you there when I roasted them? It was, it was the worst. No. Uh-oh. <laughs> it's a soul inside joke, yeah. There's bum, this bum. point in comedy, the second, like, okay, I'm an older comic, but I started kind of late. I got into it, you know, whatever. I'm a school teacher as well. But, yeah, where you start, all of a sudden you're on stage and you think, you know what, I'm going to relate. I'm going to rap. You know, or I'm going to be rock and roll back in the right. 70s and stuff. But now it'd be rapping. And that's when yeah, you pretty much need to shoot yourself. You just this, this, guy you looks know, like, yeah. this guy looks like Larry King with Down syndrome. He's oh, not, yeah. he's oh, not he's a wild. good guy. Yeah. Yeah, he's, <laughs> but, uh, super and, nice guy. A real nice guy. But you, you, can, you can cut his jokes in half and count the rings. It's horrible. Oh, but, it's uh, awful. Yeah. So, but, so, so you got Billy Bats, who you shot last Billy week. Billy Bats. And then we have Alicia May coming down. Alicia, damn it, I got her name wrong. But yeah, yeah. she's coming down. And, because uh, after that gig we did at Jimmy's, we really need to shock you. Billy <laughs> right? Was that crazy? That was, it was okay. I went to Jimmy's this week. It's all right. Fun. Yeah, it's fun. I, bar gigs suck, you yeah. know, but... It's like the independent wrestling. We were talking about her, her experience well, I was just of the independent say, wrestling. Yeah. I could relate. Uh, you got heckled by children, and you got heckled, <laughs> yeah. And But uh, but the, none of the none of the wrestling fans got out of hand. Now, did yeah. you meet the scone on the internet, too? No, we actually... Uh, we, had, we had a strange gig together. We did. Yes, and oh, she... Oh, please, Scone, tell us about it. All tell about us. it. Cheerio. Yeah, no, we, um, we went to... Um, <laughs> He's ha- from England. We have... We... <laughs> so am I. <laughs> so is my darling co-host, Jessica. Oh, Jessie! Jessie, I've got your Perrier right Meow. here. Meow. Bloody yeah. hell, you're here. Yes, uh, Josie, last time you were here, Josie was in Vietnam, oh. Uh, causing oh, more havoc right. than the Tet Offensive. And so, uh, Josie, I want to have a seat. Hello. Oh, hi, Josie. Hello, Jack Minions. Better mm-hmm. late than never. And I told everybody about your show at Skinny's next Wednesday. Oh, thank you. Where your, show, your, your band Carrera will be playing. Yes. Yes. Josie, this is, uh, you know David Berger. Of course. How you doing? You didn't know how, how much you love feet, but we're going be I don't that. love feet. I, you, know, but, but who, who, you know what it is? I dislike disgusting feet. Take care of them. You know what someone taught me a long time ago when I was young? Simply like this. If you look at a person's feet, that's how they fucking take care of the rest of them because that's yeah. the first thing showing. And you know? shoes. Josie's yeah. Yeah. Why, are, why are you in a mask? <laughs> that's the why scone. Why you in a mask? That's the scone. <laughs> yeah, scone. obviously. We, 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 he, he's in a web series with our other guests, in Vexy Lee, formerly known as Buggy Nova, formerly known as Skyler Moon from the WWE, <laughs> who is prominently featured in Wiki... She has more names than I do. Wikifeet.com. Wikifeet. Uh-huh. Yeah, uh-huh. I made it. I got to tell my parents on Wikifeet. I was doing some extensive research. <laughs> tell them how much extensive research I do on my female guys. a lot. Guys. Oh, not on you. It. Yeah. No. Not on you. I, 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 I didn't even know he was coming, so, yeah. no, 10 years. And, and, and she was on the show before, so I got her whole life story. So, mm. But uh, we were talking about the independent wrestling scene. You can just imagine. But you've done some Lucha Libre. Um, yes. Some what? Yes. I, um... Roller I, derby? Yeah, I was a ring girl. Nice. Yeah. So what? what is the strangest thing that happened to you on the independent wrestling scene? The strangest thing? Oh, well, let me tell you something. I, one of my friends who's a wrestler, he dated a porn star. Right. And something that she said has stuck with me because I can relate so much. And she said, wrestling fans are worse than porn star fans and you would think it would be the other way around because you know maybe porn star fans are like creepier or whatever but she says wrestling fans they want to be your friend they want to hang out they want to you know get your number and hang out with you outside the shows and porn star friends i mean porn star fans they just want to fuck you so you're saying the wrestling fans want to hang out with you but not fuck you i mean they want to fuck you too but (laughs) they want you to like make time out of your schedule and hang out with them and, right. and, you know, come to my birthday. It's like, I don't know you. Come to your birthday. birthday. You know, stuff like that. Have I you had requests like that? Oh, yes. Really? Yeah, but, you know, from, like, teenagers, you know, kind of younger. Like, who's the oldest one that said, come to my birthday party? Like, 48? <laughs> Mark. Mark. Uh, no. <laughs> Mark <laughs> Actually, I think I did invite you to my birthday party. I was going to Bar Sinister, but oh, that maybe. was not. Yeah, yeah. It wasn't November. Because, it was, huh? November. Exactly. We're both Scorpios. Yep. And you know what that means. Well, <laughs> it's like crazy. Yes, but uh, we, <laughs> there you go. But uh, but yeah, so uh, and you said that uh, guys have wanted to uh, buy your underwear and things like oh, that. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. But it's whatever. I mean, your socks, your wrestling gear. Oh. So what's the difference between like not being washed, ba- not just, washed? Ugh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> there's a lot of feet and ass Kill talk yourself. tonight already. <laughs> but uh, what's the difference between coming at, uh, going backstage? At like a an independent like say NWA independent show mm-hmm. or even you know you did the Glow reunion you wrestled in a WWE show. What's the difference between it's gonna, the it's two? It's gonna be a whole different thing, uh, experience, right? Yeah, um, I guess 
in, in the WWE locker room, everyone gets along. Everyone at least fake gets along. Right. Everyone's really, I mean, for the most part, we all like each other. We all see eye to eye. We all want to help each other. And it's very, like, um, supportive, right. I guess, because we're all there for, you know, we're passionate about it. And mm -hmm. we were, I don't know. It's different. So then as, as opposed well, to, Well, you're getting like, your aggression in, out, too. Yeah, that, too. Well, same with indies. Right. But I went to, recently I went to an AWS show. Nice. And he was last week. And I was talking to a girl. It was on Saturday. We yeah, together. Saturday. Scone was there. Mm -hmm. All right, and, um, I was talking to one of the girls. And I'm like, hey, how's it going? This and that. You know, after the show, we we, we drink and stuff. We party. And, and she's like, oh, I don't want to go. She's there. There's so much drama. Oh, yeah. Female and, wrestlers have the drama. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is there and, anybody you specifically have beef with? No. No. Happily, I, I can say that I don't. Right. Yeah. Right. Like, you know, <laughs> Maybe a couple of years ago. It's kind of like us. Like we, we have people that we know that are friends, and we're both friends with them, but they have beef, so they can't be yeah. near each other. Yeah. There's a lot of, in it's the so fetish community. Yeah. And comedy too. There's a lot uh, of that. There's a lot like of me. that. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Like my, I have friends right. that have friends, and I have beef with everyone, so mm. I can't ever hang out. Well, Burger's somebody that he, he will speak his mind. I will, as as you can see. I but uh, yeah, and he's starting to. You shot collars on the show. Now, do you still he loves that man? He wait, 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 wait. I was gonna ask you, do you still have the cunt of the week? Well, oh yeah, yeah. We yeah it's not the Josie week. this week, is it? God, what? never, never. We everyone never. loves. It. I'll tell you, everyone on the I'm Burger How podcast loves Josie. Like oh, everyone's really? a huge huh. fan. Yeah, there is. I love Josie. How love do you not? Josie. Yeah, she's well, see, here's, like, here's the thing. Let myself. me tell you about I'm Burger. <laughs> now, my show, I have one co-host, and trust me, that's enough. But uh, you have like five. Well. You know what it is? It's given it's given a different aspect because see my aspect is I, I don't like most people. I I just don't and you know what? And <laughs> I always tell people I can really like you. Don't worry about it. What does that mean for us? It's me. Yeah, I'm an you. asshole, fine, whatever. You know, it's not like people are jerks. No, I am. It's cool. I don't wanna know you. Don't want to be friends. You're probably going to be a letdown, you know, whatever. I, I, can, and, I can relate. Yeah. I can then relate. you got April, loves everyone. Talmo gets along with the world. Right. And, you know, he's a happy drunk. Preston, he comes from a lot of money, but he's very Republican. And then right. his girlfriend, Megan, who's, you know, grew up like me. She's poor and trashy, you know. And so, <laughs> you know, I mean, that's kind of the thing. So it's a, a good ass. The prince of the pauper. Yeah. It gives all the different, you know, variety of, excuse me, of life. It's like every white person you could ever think of. Yeah, that's uh, and you that's, know, like I'm a white Jew. You know, you get different people on the show, Italian, this and that. But everyone's right. kind of considered white. We didn't plan it that way. Well, you're kind of like me. I'm I'm one of these people that and that's why we get along. I'm not one of these people that's like buddy buddy that wants to hang out with comics till like yeah. three in the morning. It's like, oh, I, I'll hang out for a little bit. I'm like, I, 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 you know, I like there's I like people that I like, and I don't really dislike anybody. But it, it becomes the same after a while. It's like, uh. How long have you been doing it? Who are your favorite comments? It's like, I've had, yeah. I, I, I got to go. I, I got stuff to do. That's so, it's like, kill yourself. There's right. so many parallels. And it's funny because it's yeah. funny cause somebody actually asked me on Facebook a couple months ago. They're like, who's your co-host and is he funny? Which, uh, assuming there was a male comic, but I don't want a male comic. I want Josie Cat. She's a she's star. Great. And she's funny, but she's not funny like a comic. She's funny like somebody that really... Uh, <laughs> Really calls me on my bullshit. Really is what is what's so funny about it. But anyway, so uh, so Josie, the, the, the scone Sorry. is here because in Vexy Lee is in a an internet series, Pink Girl. I thought he said Pink Lady, but Pink Girl and the Scone. <laughs> yes, Pink Girl and the Scone. It's uh, uh yeah, that's his scone voice, by the way. When he does the English accent, that's the scone voice. He's gone back and forth. There's no scone times. voice. This is the scone. Hey, yes. scone. He's Hello, from scone. England. Well, yes, my 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 power is uh, that I stale like bread. And uh, I really developed hard. my powers. Yeah. I developed my powers in a in a baking accident. And I actually wasn't originally English, but the the, the scone made me become English. Uh, it's a it's a comedy documentary <laughs> superhero web series, and um, and so my hard. so so wait, so you you and, and this is Pink Girl. You, I know that you like um, you wish that she was here tonight, right? <laughs> Wait, Pink Girl looks a lot That's like... Uh, She's super hot. Get a close up on that. Yeah, yeah please go throw that throw that in the camera there. Look at there's Pink Girl. Pink girl's, pink girl's pretty hot. Yeah, she shoots pink bolts, one? but only when she's on her period. And um, not red. No, no pink bolts. It's it's a it's a it's girl pink. thing. I don't know. So oh, yeah. so, so Scone, what do you shoot when you're on your period? I don't know. I <laughs> probably projectile frowns. So you're a negative guy, Scone. Is yes, that what I it think is? so. Yeah, so even even more negative than myself. You're mm. on the most negative show on Skid Row Studios. Mm. Einberger's a close second, but we are the most negative show on Skid Row. We're Studios. not negative. We're assholes. Yeah, yes, I, we're, 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 sad, we we're sad you're angry. Yeah. 
Yeah, so angry, this is yeah. Also, so is this already on the web? Yes, we have uh, four episodes released, and um, uh, Buggy and Vexy is going to be joining us. It's so confusing. As um, <laughs> as a villainess in episodes five and six. Oh, so, so, five so, so, six. You're, so you're not pink girl. I'm not pink girl. Do I look like motherfucking pink girl to you? Oh, that, not, not at all. And don't trash talk, because <laughs> remember what happened last time. But... And she kicked me in the face. I did kick him in the face. And you're better you're looking not. than Pink Girl. Well, we, he was asking for I it. I was asking so for it. So what is your villainous name? Iron Maiden. Mm. Oh, I've heard of that before. I didn't choose it. I can't take credit. <sighs> it's all this guy. Iron Maiden. Mm. Yes. Yeah, she works for Bastard Steel. Bastard Steel. Oh, well, who's Bastard Steel? He's, he's a, he's a he's villain. He's a corrupt CEO. Oh, okay. She knows, apparently. <laughs> That's great. I didn't know you were such I a like pink that. girl and skull fan, Joseph. That's, That's the way all the comic books go. <laughs> she has <laughs> generic on it. So That's, that's just, but, but is that true? Uh, no, he's a... Uh, uh, oh. I actually... Was he a he bagel? Wants, Who he is wants he? to turn the world oh. into metal. Oh, yeah, she knows more. I know, because yes. he's my boyfriend no. in, the in, in the series. In the series. That plays all the people Strictly at Wiki in the web series. Relax. Oh, and he's played by Miko Hughes. Miko who, Hughes! Who, um... Was in Pet Cemetery Miko as Hughes. a little boy. Pet and, Cemetery, um, Full oh. House. He was on Full House. He's a he was a child oh, that actor. Dude. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, drug addict. Yeah, yeah. Nope. I no. I mean child actor. I'm sorry. Yes. <laughs> I, they, they are interchangeable. I know. My bad. No, he's not, a, not anymore. I'm sure he's on the straight and narrow. If he's in Pink Girl and, a and Stone, bit. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, right. Okay, yeah. Nice guy. He's a nice guy. He's a <laughs> he's <laughs> the, he's the trailer of Playboy nice. Show. He's you know? probably thinking of Macaulay heroin. Macaulay heroin? Oh yeah. Oh, I remember, God. yeah, I remember him, but uh, so that's very exciting. So, so no more wrestling for Invexi Lee, because mm -hmm. I was um, going to have you on when you did the. You made a big dramatic announcement. Buggy Nova is dead. I didn't say that. Long live. No, you did. Did I? Yeah, she said oh. Buggy Nova is dead. She was high. Invexi, yeah. Lee, I bet she was. <laughs> I wasn't. Invexi Lee is the new. Well, you know, I still have a Buggy Nova like page on right. Facebook, so she's not completely dead. But and, and uh, you know somebody jacked your, that name on Twitter and Instagram. Yeah, 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 yeah. And Justin, well, can you guess in Vexy Lee? We never got to that. In Vexy Lee, the meaning. Hmm. It's no. a secret. Okay. It sounds like an ad. Did she really me. beat you at arm wrestling for real? For real. She. It's not gonna for happen again. Real. It's not gonna happen again. F E R. Really. F E R. What is that? For, for real. For real. Yeah. Oh, for, for real. I thought you were. I thought you were spelling F E A R like you're afraid of me. For, yeah, for no. real. It's for real. Well, here's the thing. Here's the thing. She said she could make me tap out because she's been taking MMA lessons. Like, Ooh, a, little, I'm kinda rusty. like a like a little girl. I'm kinda rusty. Oh, come on. Like a come little on. girl. Come on. Like a little girl that she is. She's I'm really. No I mean, I'm really good at punching and kicking and kneeing people in the face. He but... doesn't care. He's into yeah. that shit. Yeah. <laughs> if I could beat you at arm wrestling, will you wrestle him? If you could beat me. Yeah. You'll probably beat me. I'm 140 pounds. I, I trust. With here's what kids. happened. Here's what happened yeah. last time, Burger. I was on my way to beating her easily. Oh. Josie will tell you when I wrestle and get in combat with women. I was I wrestled since you were here. I wrestled the world's tallest model, Amazon Eve. Amazon. She's the blonde, right? Right. Yeah. And it was, I know her. It was a well, very you know competitive match. Whoa, I bet. I wish right, I could have seen that. Oh, you loved every minute of it. It was very competitive. <laughs> I, um, I, 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 I'd say it was a draw, wouldn't you say? Really? It was a draw of something. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was a draw. So, you getting your ass beat. So, yeah, I, and I, I, I've but also, he still somehow wins. I also the, the, I wrestled the, uh, the Charlie Haynes Salt from Glow. Okay. We had a little tussle, and uh, she, I, my head ended up between her legs. But Ooh, that's what I wanted. Yeah. That's exactly. <laughs> well, actually, I wanted, I wanted Josie. Placement. I wanted Josie to wrestle her. Now that you're here, maybe you can take on the uh, oh, wrestle for me. What do you think? Do it. Oh shit! Oh, yeah. Sorry. oh man. Yeah. Either way. Okay. Forget Josie. Damn you want to wrestle a real man? Oh, he's, that's a straight challenge. Don't you know what? I got two daughters. Don't you ever let someone real man you because there's no such thing. There's no you such thing. You shut up, bitch. I'm going to tell you. I'm this telling you right now. There's no such thing. Shut up, cheeseburger. Yeah, I'm going to tell, tell you something right <laughs> now. There's no way. I we, I we Don't let me take this off. Take it off. I, I'm, yeah. we're gonna, take it off. First off, Do I mean, it. there's Look no it, way. Boom. There's no way. She doesn't give a shit. I'm standing up right now. You got the wrong woman right here. Buggy Nova, little girl. Here we go. That's the wrong woman, man. Look at that. I'm telling you. There's no way a little girl like you. She wrestled, got perfect ever. teeth. You don't want to fuck with her. <laughs> you may yeah, you you never want to get away with that <laughs> with, <laughs> with, with AJ Lee and the wusses in the WWE and Sheamus. Ooh. Ooh. 
with. Whoop do his it, do ass. It. You uh, okay. have never wrestled a real Whoop man. Whoop his ass. I just want to say. Yeah. Kids, don't try this at home. No, don't. <laughs> just want to say you're scared, you're no, petrified, no, no, no. you're shaking. I don't want to punch you. It's okay. I don't want to punch you. I don't want to punch you. Just kick him. I give you yeah. permission. No, well, okay. Mark's got I mean, burn marks on him that can't okay. be explained. Yeah. <laughs> fuck what, him up. If Josie says it's cool. Yeah. Well, Josie, Please Josie do. Berger Encourage. and Stone. We're, first off, don't want to say this off, okay? You haven't antagonized me enough, so I'm going to sit down, but... Oh, you you, what a you are so Get up and whoop his You are so lucky. What kind of wrestler is this? What kind of trash talk is this? You are the villain. I'm in a skirt. Look, look, wait, Second of all, these, even better. These two little girls are oh. watching you right oh, now. Oh, baby girl. Do you want to arm wrestle again? Is that what you want to do? My soccer buddy. Athletes. Athletes. Do you want to arm wrestle again? Is that what you want to do? Show these women. Show these women that that motherfucker can't. Who am I going to arm wrestle? What'd you say? You want to arm wrestle me? We could arm wrestle. You ready to do I'm good with that. Because I, f- I beat your ass leg last wrestle. time. Do a leg wrestle. I don't remember that. I'll fucking leg wrestle. Leg wrestle. Shit. Okay. Leg wrestle. I got good legs. Yeah. I got good legs. Right. That's good legs. Do it. Come on. Let's do, do it. it. Go, go. Re- go. Or do you want to leg go. wrestle? Leg wrestle. We were arm wrestle last time. Oh, forget. Don't let me take yeah, this okay. off. You already arm wrestled. Leg wrestle. Look, bitch, I don't know if you know what you're, what you're in for. Leg I wrestle. will leg wrestle you. Uh-oh. Leg wrestle, Mark. Smackdown. Mark. Leg wrestle. I'm pretty confident. You're pretty confident? You're going to leg wrestle me? Do it, Mark. How confident are you? Because I, I don't think you know what you're in for. Oh, do it. These are some big legs. I'm I'm like a, a six and a half confident out of six and a half. Whoa. I don't, I don't know where you got that Ooh. number. I think, <laughs> that's yeah, that I think the Stones are showing you so the best scale. Gonna whoop I don't your know. Ass. <laughs> wrestling. Yes. Are we doing it? Yeah, he's down. Okay. Uh-oh. Yeah, nothing scares uh-oh. him, uh-oh. but you know what? He's he t- going to he get his ass his whooped. eyeliner. Sometimes. I got, my, I got my lipstick on the counter, that's baby. a lot of gay shit, man. That's... But Some, you, ready, sometimes ready leg wrestling can yeah. be a stepping this? stone to I burn a town. I don't think you're ready. Let's do this. Let's do it. Vexy Lee. Oh, what a wussy Lee. I mean, Vexy Lee. I'm not bugging over anymore. I'm going to make you cry so hard your fucking eyeliner is going to oh, run. I love that. So I won't be talking yeah. shit. Oh, I like her. Right. Scone. Wait, do you burger, get an interest theme song? Yeah. Do it. You get your entrance theme song or something? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Here Play comes and Vexy Lee. <laughs> That was a lot of fireworks for her. Oh, that got good. What is that, Miley Cyrus? That's horrible. <laughs> it's a party and she's... Okay. It's a party. You sound like Coldplay. What kind of theme song is that? Here comes Mark. <laughs> Damn. Damn. Here comes Mark. Damn. Damn. I want to watch this. All right. Lay down. All right. With your leg up. All right. How's the not very good. Oh, We're getting good. Yeah, there we go, buddy. We there we go. Going. He's in. He's ready for go. this. This motherfucker's a horny little dude. He knows what's up. <laughs> okay, ready? Okay, lift your leg up. All right. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Go. I'm totally picturing this without Mark, and it's turning me on. <laughs> <laughs> I got to tell you. I know. It's a shame Mark is in the picture. I thought you had to flip him over. Wait a second. Watch this. There you go. Good luck with that. There you go. Ready? Wait. <laughs> Wait, how do I'm just going to run over there and over. elbow drop both of you. How's that sound? Just jump on them. I should. Dog pile. Dog pile. You got to flip him that way. I got to fucking flip him. Oh, do it. We got to count this off, right? Uh-oh. Yeah, flip Josie, him. Josie, you, ca- flip you him count like it off. No. I don't know what's happening. Oh, I don't yeah. oh the what action is hot. Either way, oh, look like, at that. On over there. She's got Already double wrapped, wrapped in around in his leg. Just by ankles. No. Yeah. Oh. I still say she won. Oh, oh. oh. He's We're turning. Walls. He's turning. Oh, no. He's got her. He's in pain. This is. Mark is in pain. I've never quite seen anything like this. Oh, he's dead. Oh, he's dead. He's been training about this for a long time. Yeah. I had no idea what happened. It's excellent. Oh, the strength of estrogen. My God, I love it. Yay, Stretchy Where's Where's the title belt? Where's my belt? Mm. There's a steel chair right there, though. Grab that. Yeah, just hit him with that. <laughs> yeah. I only knew there was a steel chair there. <laughs> that's good. I well, think that's you're his my exercise hero, Mark. for another I think month. you're truly my hero. <laughs> Who's that, me or Invexy Lee? You. Oh, okay. You're my hero. I beat her. I yeah. got your leg down. It was no. easy. No. No, no, you're not my hero because you won because you were doing that with her. Yeah. She's not my hero because she was Why doing do you it think, with you. Burger, you yeah. have comedians on your show. Yeah. I have beautiful wrestlers like this yeah. on my show. Thank what you. do you think I'm going to do? Oh, yeah. This, by far. <laughs> I've been trying to leg wrestle Josie for a year now. 
Yeah, I got to tell you, I'm glad I did this show because by far, so few people. Yeah, people are just blah. You're not blah. Thank you. Yeah, you uh, that, I will blah. Say. That's, that I will say. And I, that's the point I made last time because the WWE Divas are sort of, as of late, sort of interchangeable. Yeah. And I know that uh, we talked about last time that you uh, <clears throat> you you were... You had you were in rehab and you had an eating disorder and mm -hmm. it was funny because in my extensive research, probably should have researched leg Hilarious. wrestling, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> you were on some other podcast. It was a wrestling podcast, and the first thing they said is, "Oh, she's gonna she's gonna talk about her eating disorder and WWE," which I thought was pretty fucked up. Oh, I think I remember that. Yeah, it's, it's still on the internet like that, which is like that's the least interesting thing about you. Oh, I guess so. At the time, because everyone was like, what happened to her? Where'd she go? Oh, okay. So it was when it happened. So, so yeah, I think at the time it was more appropriate. But. Right. So uh, does that preclude a, a return to WWE? Is that, is that what's happening? Question mark. Ooh. Mm. I would watch. To be continued. And if you if you can get back, I can get back because that was a very competitive match. Oh yeah, I'll send that it to him. I, I'm gonna text Hunter right now. Let oh, him know. Oh please, Hunter. Oh, yeah. I don't know who's Hunter. Triple H. Oh Triple H. Okay, <laughs> come on, yeah, I need your help on this. But, uh, I uh, haven't. If she had said Hunter. if she had said text Paul, that would have been breaking kayfabe. Oh though. yes. Mm -hmm. Who's if, Paul? If she would have said mm -hmm. Macho Man Randy Savage, I have yeah, been yeah, I'm going to text, text a dead man right now. That's I was 15 I'm watching saying. wrestling. The Ultimate Having Warriors sex. on speed yeah. dial right now. We're going to yeah. get him on the phone. Legit. Yeah, I was trying to look around a woman to see the wrestling match on WWF yeah. wrestling. Oh, that was yeah. the best. Yeah. Yes. And that's how into it I was. I was yeah. like 15. Yeah, so same with me. That's why I said, because I outgrew it, but apparently... Some grown men in the mask didn't, but yep. uh, <laughs> she, also, she started out modeling, and that's how she got into wrestling. Wow. Yeah, who knew? So, so and, that, and her modeling name was Buggy Nova, which is a synonym <laughs> for crazy, and you can see why. Crazy star. Yes, exactly. And so, nope. <laughs> uh, so uh, I was going to, uh, so acting is more where you're going now. I guess so. I dabble. You know, I do what I can. I'm going to school. Well, Gotta yeah, do the big girl thing, and then, you know, I do the, the fun stuff on the side. I think so. you just did the what big girl thing. Yeah. <laughs> I am a big girl now. Yeah, you probably Thank you, down. Dark Mark. Yes. And, and, I am a woman. Uh, yes. Once you leg wrestle Dark Mark. There's really nothing else. Yeah. You're really yeah. You've done it. <laughs> I made it. Yeah. You did. You did. But uh, I was going to say, why do you think that, I mean, <clears throat> I know The Rock's an anomaly, but it seems like uh, male wrestlers are having some success in the movies, but not female wrestlers. Yeah. Why do you think that is? Well, you know, I heard one of my female diva friends mm -hmm. has a role in a movie now that's oh, coming yeah. out. Oh, good. Because um, doesn't know, WWE I don't even know have a studio? Doesn't what? Come on, break some news on the Dark March. I'm always listening. Well, she yeah. posted pictures, so Summer Rae is coming out in, okay. a, in a movie. Oh, good. Yeah. yeah. So that's the only one that I know of. Um... I don't know. I know that WWE, they have their own production thing sure, going yeah. on. So maybe they have a they, movie studio. and uh, Yeah, I think maybe they put them in the movies to get a broader audience or to introduce them to you know you know, that people that don't watch Tamina's wrestling. Tamina's going to be in uh, Hercules. Is she really? Yeah, she's got a, a bit part in that. Well, maybe we should talk to the wrestling fan because he seems to know a lot more. He knows more than I do. Now, are you into the guys or the girls? I mean, are you really into the... Uh, Obviously, you're into Bucky Dolan. What are you doing over there, um, David? Oh, Nestor, who's in the... Yeah, there he is. Oh, my <laughs> gosh. There's a That's the llama face. There's a vagina oh. over there. Oh, I thought yes. that was the llama face. Oh. Yeah. Okay. You're doing a llama face. Oh. So, so uh, I mean, when, <laughs> sure, you go, when you go to wrestling uh, shows, do you wear the mask? Uh, No, no. I don't. Okay. But, and you don't speak in an English accent, I'm, I would hope. No, then my the palate is English. Me. It's not an accent. No, but I, I've actually... Well, I've always accent. been a friend, a, a fan of... The, of <laughs> Of of watching women's wrestling, I think that um, because when I was a kid, I watched you know the Undertaker and all of those people right, in the eighties, right. and I didn't know that women actually wrestled. And then I, the first match I saw was uh, like Jacqueline versus Sable during the Attitude Era. Right. And I thought boner. Oh, women can do this too. I, it was more of an like an, uh, an <laughs> well, appreciation you're going of the pu puberty, though, of right? the underdog thing. And some of the some of it was yes, going through puberty, but most of it was an appreciation of like oh, they they allow women to do this too, and I think that's amazing. Right. Yeah. So, uh, it's, but um, and it's a proper. I'm a yes. proper lad. So He's proper. a pro proper lad. Proper lad. He's a good like boy. Yeah. He's all right. He's a little bugger. Because because there is yeah it's uh, and um, but what about because uh, last time we were talking to you there was this other thing called TNA. Oh yeah, that's still going on. Tits and ass. I mean, are no, we no. Not there's a wrestling organization called TNA. <laughs> oh, okay. which I was like, wait a second. <laughs> but apparently they're yeah, going TNA out of business. Impact. I was looking. Yeah. I was looking Are at really? that. It looks like they're not doing so well. I don't know. Yeah, they're having mm -hmm. some trouble, which is 
too bad. See, I knew to go to the scone. Scone, how's T and A going? It's it's a it's a shaky. I mean, both both products are on shaky legs right now. It's Wrestling a, is really a dying art. Right. That's what I think. So what about off? that WWE Network? Do you know what? about that? What? I can't hear you. Hello, Mindy. Oh. Mindy said about the WWE, WWE Network. Network. Yeah. What about it? Network yeah. Do you know yeah. anything about it? I don't. I know. Do you well, get any I don't royalty, know. royalty checks? Because I'm sure they show some of your NXT I wish. They should. <laughs> they show like but everything. Do you know if they showed any NXT, any of the stuff that you did? No, not that I know of. Mm. Not that I know of. Okay. Good I think it's badass you were a wrestler. Good That's question, Mindy. Cool. Yeah. Which was, I'm glad Mindy interjected because, <laughs> Josie, I know you're starting a band with Mindy. <gasps> what? Oh, what? Yeah. Guess who plays guitar? No way. Yeah. And you have another yeah. uh, wrestling friend of yours that wanted to be in a band with you, or is that? That's a right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, singer, guitar player, bassist. Yeah, he's got a band already. Oh, it's a guy. Yeah, it's a guy. Mm. So let's bring guys. Last I'll play. Time, last time you brought Nixon. Nixon. And by the way, and last Nixon. time Nixon was on the show, Josie's like, "I want you to sit on my lap," and he he sat on her lap, so Aww. that was real nice. Yeah. Remember Nixon sat on your lap? Yeah. <laughs> so now you bring a guy with a wrestling mask. I, I don't know what's coming next. He knows well, Josie he can tell you more shit. about, the, about the, the web series one than I can. So. Well, we're we're, we're going to get to that. I, I want to yeah. get back to Burger for a second. Oh, no, yeah, for sure. We're, like I said, it goes by so fast. We've only got, we've only got eight minutes. <laughs> yeah, no one cares about don't, me. No, no, I do care about you. Yeah. Your, your show's coming out of 10. It's fun. What, what, uh, and it's funny because, as you can see, this show has no topics. I love it. I Everybody think asks me, like, like, what's the topic this week? Sometimes guests ask me. We never have a topic. We just let the right. conversation flow. That's what your topic like is, it. conversation. I like yeah, I get people. I get to know them. Yeah. And then, uh, you know, and then I, uh, I ask them questions about themselves. And, we talk and about comedy. feet. Talk about feet. We talk about feet a lot. Yeah. Josie showed her feet once. It was a whole thing. Hey, nice but, uh, feet. Yeah. Oh, actually, she has nice feet, too. On, yeah. on, on our one-year anniversary. She does. Okay. Would you take off your, your boots and we'll see who has the best feet? We haven't done this in a while. I'm down. I'm wearing fishnets. Can I leave those? Yeah, on? I'll judge you there. I'm, another, I'm very another foot, another foot contest that. here. A foot contest. Foot contest. <laughs> you up for this? No, she's, I'm she's in She's wearing playbook. sandals. She's wearing, well, perfect. I'm in boots. I yeah. got to unhook these. Boots. No, no, because you're going to have to wear shorts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't know Burger was so under feet. That's what we're going to You know what it is? You know what it is? I'm not. I'm just like, wait, okay. My thing is like, I don't think guys should ever, ever ever wear flip-flops that's a good Period. that's a good point i'm not Unless I'm, I'm you're on with the you on sand that. at the beach and then it better be in hawaii or some freaking place where it's exactly. all the time i'm not yeah. at the sandals myself right, right. Uh, yeah thank you but we're all yeah. in agreement here because Is Maxine, why, you like why guys as a man have you hit a point where you don't need to ever do man shit you know and, and like Maxine, do you like, do you do like do better flip-flops you know i have no opinion if a guy with flip-flops came up to you start talking to you i mean on a first date if he wore flip-flops i'd i'd be like uh Stone, yeah. I could see how it would be annoying, but I don't yeah. notice those things. You went to flip flops, oh, yeah. Oh no, I mean, I'll wear them if I need to run to my car really quick. But Faggot. like, no, if I. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't wear them to go out. If you're on a date, don't fucking wear flip flops. Really? Yeah. yeah. Oh god. Where, when, was go time, when was the last time a guy wore, wore flip flops on a date with uh, Invexi Lee? God, you know what? I can't even tell you the last time I went on a. Date. Oh, really? That sounds really sad. <laughs> well, it doesn't sound that sad because, uh, uh, you know, uh, there is the Symbol 6 release party that's coming up on yeah. Saturday. There's also the Carrera show on Wednesday. Yeah. And, yeah. Let's go. Ooh. All right. Are you going to hook me up with someone, Dark Mark, or? He was thinking him. Oh. He was thinking him. He's quick. He's, he's really thinking he him. Gotcha. He, he's I was going to hook you up with, I was gonna hook you with the master of leg wrestling. Oh, the master. <laughs> the master. I wonder who that could be. Yeah. yeah. The one that pinned you right away. I don't remember uh, that. I think she gave you that one. I made you chop out. No, no, it's funny. Yeah. That's the same thing happened. Anyway, I don't want to get into it. But anyway, so so what's the topic this week? Because we don't have, yeah, we don't do topics. Well, you but know you what we're talking topics. about? We're, we're talking about, I don't know if you're aware, but Corey Feldman just came out with a, his book talking about all the pedophilia in Hollywood. And this is a big thing to me oh because God, because uh, the reason Hollywood and movies and, and, and art itself is dead and sucks and the reason comedy is dead and it sucks is because... The only people getting in are the kids of the people who actually had talent oh. or the people willing to suck everyone else's dick, whatever it be. Whether Josie. it be a woman, a man, a man, a woman, however it works, everyone is grabbing and taking and it's not about talent anymore and it's not working oh. your way up. And so it's about Corey Feldman, yeah, uh, and so Feldman came out with his book and starts talking about it, Ryan Singer thing, all that. And then we're talking about Sergeant Deserter. Brian Singer, yeah, Brian yeah. Singer, yeah. And then the Deserter guy, we got a, a Marine in Mexico who made a mistake, an illegal U-turn. Right. He's in Mexico prison. Oh. But the Deserter who got I caught deserting by the Afghani people has been traded for five uh, terrorists. 
which I don't believe in terrorism anyway. But by, by the way, I was in a Mexican jail for uh, for a few hours. Shut up! I was pleasant. in there for about a week and a half. How terrifying okay. is that? Well, was, Rito, well, it was on spring break, so I was in there with a bunch of white bad. guys. Yeah, no? they're not. Well, I had to go to the transfer place once they transfer you from the holding. Oh, and you, where, where, Yeah, where they take you to the main jail before you go big house. Right. And so it was about a week well, and a half. Well, you're from so you knew Spanish. Yeah. Well, funny enough, yeah, and I was in there with two of my buddies, so it wasn't so, a big uh, deal. <laughs> but yeah. Well, I was in there with three of my buddies, and I was, uh, and I, I almost sat on the toilet, which was a blanket, but I don't want to get into it. But uh, right, the little <laughs> thing in the middle, the hole. Oh, Are you, that uh, me? Yeah. Uh, I've, I've been in Sonata, Rosarita, and then like uh, actual Tijuana. Mexico, Mexico. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like afraid to even like go to Mexico. <laughs> the blanket. What's Nowadays the blanket? it's different. Well, wait, wait, yeah, wait, wait, it's cool. Yeah, well, yeah. you know, since you haven't been on a date in a while, I'm going to take you to Mexico, and we're going to wear flip flops. How about that? Huh? Uh, <laughs> A Mexican prison for your first date. Oh my god! I, never a Mexican prison. I know some. I know some cool places in Tijuana. Okay. I think I'm gonna be washing my hair. Oh, okay, okay. that yeah. whole night. But anyway, so uh, the where does hair. the time go? Uh, uh, so burger on burger, ten o'clock every night, ten to eleven. Yes, sir. Just, just. Put it on Skid Row at eight. Keep going through eleven. You're All gonna laugh a lot. It's the greatest three hours of any. Uh, well, form you know, of NBC's dropped their sitcom lineup, so this is the comedy <laughs> night right here on Skid Row Studios. The only originality in entertainment. This is the thing. None of us have anybody who's helping us. That's all. A We're Godfrey just doing show, it. then a crazy it. barber yeah. shop in Spanish Harlem, oh, yeah. and then you with five five comics just screaming about Insane. the comedy. You're, yeah. you're, I, I say you're, you're like you're like a hippie anarchist. I love you. I <laughs> that's a good way to put it. Tommy told me one time, you're, you're an Alberger, you're wicked, just wicked. That you're wrong. You're wicked. Uh, are, are you doing a scone voice too? No, it's scone. my Tommy voice. <laughs> scone. Okay. How do we get to Pink Lady and Scone? How do we see this? Because everybody wants to see this. Oh, it's on it's on it's on the YouTube's, and we have a we have a Facebook page, and um, yeah, it, it's Pink Girl and Scone, not it, Pink Lady. It's, it's yeah, the new adventures of Pink Girl and Scone. The new adventures. Did you have old adventures of Pink Girl and Scone? Yes. Oh my God, they're terrible. <laughs> and, and Are they in black still... and white? Is like uh, Lucia Ball in them or something? Basically, they're they're on mini DV that was shot uh, over five years Holy ago. Holy crap! So it's, mini yeah. DV, they still make that? I know. Yes. <laughs> it's, 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 yeah, I thought I thought that went the way of uh, Beta and uh, and uh, the Dat. Mm -hmm. But are, uh, are you are you a comic book fan at all? Though uh, so I'll go with it. Go ahead. Okay. Well, because I, I would say that th this show is like um, as if the JLA exists. You know, Superman. Justice League of America. Yeah, they're they're around. Right. But then, like, elongated man and like you know, the, I remember like, elongated the, the, man. Yeah, the, the lamest superheroes are like trying a trying their best to like, get and, around. Yeah, yeah. I, know, I know those. And then we're all we're and we're just the most ridiculous people. So it's it's, it's so funny. So you're worse yeah. than elongated man. Oh yes, you're I'm worse than Phantom Stranger. I mean, I stay like bread. I have a terrible power. <laughs> it's so good. You have <laughs> to watch like it. Like, you stay like bread. You know, it, that could come in handy once in a while. Scone, so how do we get a hold of you specifically uh, on social media? On social media. I think we, I believe we have a Twitter. It's been, you know, Pink Girl's better at it than me. Oh, look, twitter.com, PG and the Scone. Thank goodness I brought PG these. And the scone. Yeah. PG and the Scone. PG yeah. and the Scone. And Vexy PG Lee, and the, the woman of many names. Uh, I tell you, it goes by so fast every time you're here. You're a delight. Uh, next uh, time, let's see, we arm wrestled, we leg wrestled. Arm wrestle, foot contest. Well, then, we didn't do the foot contest. Next uh, time, we'll do the foot contest. Yeah, next time. Yeah, and then and we got a date, we got to set up. So, how do people get a hold of you? Uh, Besides Wiki Feet. Facebook, uh, in Vexy Lee, Facebook slash Buggy Nova for my like page, and Twitter in Vexy Lee. Or no, Twitter in Vexy. I was trying to find your Twitter. I didn't Twitter, know. Twitter, I, I think, in Vexy is spelled with two eyes. I don't know. I confuse myself sometimes. Okay, well, Facebook in Vexy Lee. Facebook, yeah. Facebook, Instagram. Are, are you still Instagram in Vexy? Yeah. Okay, because I was, I, was, I was trying to search that because I think I was uh, I am Buggy Nova's last I had. Oh, that's and right. And Josie, tell us about your gig and tell us where we can find you. Um, just Google me, Josie J O S I Cat K A T, and you'll find my Twitter, and you'll see some flyers on there. Next week. Fire and transsexual porn stars. Ooh, yeah. And go to gothcomedian.com. Goth, that's the new website. Check it out. And I, I'm very proud of it. Yay. I had nothing to do with it, so I paid a, a guy to do it. It's very good. Cool. Twitter. Twitter. Uh, and go to darkmarkshow.com. Get your Audible free book and a 30-day free trial. Go to damatisgoth.com. Get 10% off every T-shirt. I didn't even do the sponsors. Everybody have a wonderfully creepy week. Bye. Bye.